1. Can you explain the importance of boundary value analysis in manual testing? Boundary value analysis is a testing technique where the testers evaluate the behavior of an application at the boundaries of input ranges. For instance, if an input field accepts values from 1 to 100, boundary values would include 1, 100, and values just above and below these limits. This technique is crucial because many defects are often found at the extremes of the input domain. Example, consider a scenario where a system accepts ages from 18 to 60. Boundary value analysis would involve testing with values 17, 18, 60, and 61 to ensure the system behaves correctly in these edge cases. 2. What is the difference between equals equals and equals in Java? In Java, equals equals is used for comparing primitive data types, checking if they have the same value. On the other hand, equals is a method used for comparing the content of objects, especially strings, to check if they are logically equal. Example, string str1 equals new string hello, string str2 equals new string hello, slash slash using equals equals to compare references. Address is system.out.println str1 equals equals str2, slash slash output, false slash slash using, equals to compare content system.out.println str1 dot equals str2, slash slash output, true. 3. Explain the concept of encapsulation in Java. Encapsulation is one of the four fundamental loop concepts. It refers to the bundling of data attributes, and the methods that operate on that data into a single unit, i.e., a class. This helps in restricting access to some of the object's components and preventing the accidental modification of data. Example, public class employee, private string name, private integer, slash slash getter and setter methods for encapsulated data public string get name, return name public void set name string name, this dot name equals name. 4. Can you name some commonly used interfaces in the Java Collection Framework? Some commonly used interfaces in the Java Collection Framework include list, set, map, queue, and collection. These interfaces provide a blueprint for implementing classes that represent dynamic data structures. Example list names list equals new array list set numbers set equals new hash set map page map equals new hash map. 5. What is web driver in Selenium, and how is it different from Selenium IDE? Web driver is a powerful tool in Selenium for automating browsers. It provides a programming interface for driving the browser, interacting with web elements, handling events, and navigating between pages. In contrast, Selenium IDE is a record and playback tool, primarily used for prototyping and learning. Example web driver driver equals new Chrome driver, driver.gethttps colon slash slash www.example.com, web element search box equals driver.findElement by dot name Q, search box dot send key Selenium web driver, search box dot submit. 6. Explain the concept of implicit and explicit weights in Selenium. Implicit weight sets a global timeout for the driver to wait for an element to be present before throwing an exception. Explicit weight, on the other hand, allows the driver to wait for a certain condition to be met before proceeding. It's more specific and can be applied to individual elements. Example colon slash slash implicit weight. Applied globally driver dot manage timeouts implicitly wait 10 time unit dot seconds slash slash explicit wait waiting for an element to be clickable web driver wait wait equals new web driver wait driver 10 web element element equals wait dot until expected conditions dot element to be clickable by dotted some element id 7 what is the purpose of using TestNG in Selenium automation testing? TestNG is a testing framework that facilitates the testing process by providing features like annotations, parallel execution, and grouping of test methods.
It enhances the organization of test cases, simplifies test configuration, and supports the creation of flexible and maintainable test suites. Example import org.thesn.annotations.test, public class my test, at test public void test case 1, slash slash test logic here. 8. What is BDD, and how does Cucumber support it in Selenium? BDD, Behavior Driven Development, is an approach that encourages collaboration between developers, QA, and non technical stakeholders by using natural language specifications. Cucumber supports BDD by allowing test scenarios to be written in Gherkin language, making them human readable and allowing automatic execution. Example feature Search functionality on a website scenario Searching for a product given I am on the home page when I enter laptop in the search bar and I click the search button then I should see search results. 9. How do you see the role of a QA automation engineer in an agile development environment? In agile, a QA automation engineer plays a crucial role in ensuring the continuous testing and integration of software. They collaborate closely with developers, participate in sprint planning, and provide quick feedback on the quality of the code. Automation helps in achieving faster and more reliable testing supporting the iterative development process.